Hey guys, it's Skulker3 and welcome to part 9 of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons. In the last part, we got the rock's feather. Go away. In this part, we're gonna continue. Go away. No. Excuse me. I didn't want you here last time. What makes you think I want you here now? Hmm? You think I just suddenly changed my mind and you're awesome now? Well, no. Believe it or not, you're still a bitch. I don't even think I need to go this way, but I'm sure he's all gonna do it. Just to stick it to the man and stick it in his craw. And I don't know what a craw is. And I don't think I really want to know at all. Um. Oh, actually, I think we might want to go this way. Come to think of it. Because then we can do this. Oh, so close. I'll get it next time. Hang on. How do we do this? Oh, <laughs> well, you know, running out of running out of the Pegasus seeds isn't gonna help. Oh wait, no, we don't need to. We don't need to speed at all. I am really stupid. You just need to jump over the button. Um. Oh yeah, I remember these guys. Vaguely. Yeah. Um. What you do? You get yourself this thing. Yep. Throw one out of the water. He jumps around, and you slice him to bits with the sword. And it's all good. You can also kill it. You can also hurt him while he's jumping around, but he's hard to hit. So you know. Yeah, he he does escape your grasp, but you know, it's not a problem. Um, I don't know why. He kind of reminds me of Omanyte, um, from Pokemon, as opposed to Omanyte from Mario or something. Because you know, Omanyte is so many things in the world. Um, and so finally there's just one left, you get him, you throw him, you slice him, you slice him again, and he's dead! All is well, and we get to claim a fairy, which is nice, and then we go up the stairs! Um, I don't think we can actually do anything up here yet. Um, we might be able to drop down, or something. In fact, I think we do drop down, or something. Um... So let's just see what's going on over here. And if I'm mistaken, I will treat you all to ice cream. So yeah. Um we can actually do something over here. We can fall down here like a madman. Um into this room. Whoa! Excuse me. I didn't order this. I don't need to move that yet, I know. I just wanted to for my own peace of mind. I get the feeling I've monumentally screwed this up. Yes. Of course I have. What else could I have done in my life? Hmm. I'm confused now. How do you do this one again? I don't know, but I have to go all the way around. Actually, no. I don't. I am a liar pants, and I should be stabbed by a mercenary with a Pokemon. What Pokemon, you ask? It's up to you. I'm quite partial to Squirtle myself, because, you know, tiny turtle thing, pretty funky. Um, wait, I've just remembered something. Sorry, I will be back. Don't, don't interrupt, Mr. Guy. Oh, oh yeah, there is something around here. You go up here, you go up there, and you go over here. However, it's not a key, so that's unnecessary. You are just a gasher seed. Of course you are. There's a gasha seed in every single one, and, you know. Uh, however, that leaves the remaining treasure chest to be the boss key, so, you know. It's apples and oranges, really. I don't know what I mean by that, but... Something. There's a lot of there's a lot of idioms I don't know what they mean. Like, swings and roundabouts. I don't know what that means. Um, well, that's the only one I can think of right now. Um, so, yeah. You? I didn't remember you being there. You crazy little... Why are there so many glob things here suddenly? They weren't here last time. Whee! We're falling to our death. Um... Okay, we can't push that like that. Help! I'm being killed. Uh... Okay. Aha! It was so simple! Actually, I could have done that before, but you know. Um, obviously I didn't know. Because I'm quite frankly very, very silly. Um, and I hope you don't mind. But, oi, you can all just... You know what? 
I don't need to kill you, but I'm going to. You know, you, you, made, you made me change my mind. I was gonna let you live, but no. After that shameful display, I'm gonna just, I'm, you know, and I know I've already killed you, so there's no point in me talking to you anymore, but still. It's it's the matter of the thing. It's the it's a matter of principle, quite frankly. Um, or as we in England say, um, it's a matter of headmaster. But, you know. Um Yeah. So, jumping over to here and over to the right. I'm sorry. Sorry if I didn't talk right there. The microphone has been unplugged, and I don't know how long it's been unplugged for. Probably forever. But, you know, that'll be fun to see in editing. So here is Poison Moth. He's not a tough boss, really, particularly. He's just a bit annoying. Because if you fall down there, as is fairly easy to do, I think he, like, basically regains all his health. Ah, I could be mistaken. And probably am. Just keep slashing him to pieces until he explodes. As is the pattern with pretty much any boss. Actually, come to think of it. You see, <laughs> I don't think I've ever done that in my previous time, is that I always forget you can just go onto the bit outside, and you'll be absolutely fine. Um, and then he'll just basically keep flying around until he meets you, and then you just slash him to pieces. Very, very easy. We've got the bright sun, an essence of nature. Young shoots grow quickly under the warm rays of the bright sun! Of course they do, you silly man. Um, so yeah, we've now got our third essence of nature. Uh, I'm quite surprised I managed to remember that it's essences of nature up to this point. I'm pretty certain eventually I call them essences of seasons, but whatever. Thank, Thank you, Link. Link. I, I too feel the bright sun, but the powers of darkness do not weaken. Instead, they grow stronger. How can this be? Link, I dreamt of the waterfall in the mountain north of Sunken City. Perhaps the next essence is near there. Maybe it is. Whee! Ah, I like that. Um, now, we want to make it summer again. Because summer's the best time of all. Except for when it's not. Um. Now, there is a heart piece down there, but I can't figure... Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, this is really summer, isn't it? Um. Yeah. What was I going to say? Um, there's a heart piece down there. But I can't quite figure out how to get it. Uh, don't tell me. Because I'll, I'll try to work it out on my own. And or use a walkthrough, but yeah. Um, it's just... I can't really remember it. Ah! Hey! You're not allowed to move! What do you think this is? Thailand? Nah. Um, I'm not sure what I meant by that, but whatever. You can all go and die, Mr. Tektite. Link, you're my best customer. Take this special glyph. Special glyft? Special glyft? I don't want a glyft! Are you mad? But if you dig this spot here, you get a ring, which is good for something, I expect. My secret. Read in summer when vines grow. Oh, yeah. Um, that was from Vazu as well. He was saying, hey, look up there. It's a ring. Isn't that crazy? Uh, oh, dear. Oh, bugger off. <laughs> this was not the best plan I've ever had. Oi. You're not allowed to just suddenly appear and hurt me. That's, that's against the rules. You don't have the right, good sir, to do such a thing. I have to revoke your license now. Wait a minute. Oh, never mind. Of course, the Pegasus seeds that one, isn't it? Silly me! Oh, here is Maple again. I'm gonna go for it, I think. Destroy the sign! Nope. I don't want to read it. Die, sign! Die! Uh, so, Maple, come and give me a hug! I want a hug, a hug, a hug, a hug, hug. Hey, there's a ring. That's probably the only good thing there. Yes, 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 I do. I hate you now. Let's go. Yoink. Yoink. Very easy. Thank you very much, madam. Um, so let's head on out to other places which we don't know. Um, so, where do we want to go now? Um, well, we want to go over here for one thing, and there, like that. Then we want to move around in several different directions like a crazy man. Um, do we want... Ah! No, we don't want to go over there, thank you very much. I've changed my mind, alright. Jeez, I'm allowed to change my mind, aren't I? Um, so, okay, down here, there's something you can do in summer. But beyond that, no. Down there is something you can do in autumn, because you can pick the mushrooms in autumn, which is pretty funky. 
Um, we can now get over to here as well, which I think we need to do... do we? Yeah, this is how we get to this bit, which is the area leading to Sunken City. Um, ah! Excuse me, good sir. I don't remember requesting that in an email. <laughs> I was going for the Octorok, but whatever. Um, there we go. Um, yeah, I don't want to continue the next bit just yet. Because uh, I'm weird like that, you know? Um, I like, when I've finished a dungeon, I just like to chill with a glass of um, tartar sauce and, you know, just whistle the day away. Um, making up tunes that I don't know and I don't think exist, really, all things considered. Uh, so, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna see... I'm just gonna check something here. No, I didn't plant any gasha seeds. Um, basically, okay, in uh, Sabrosia, uh, you can buy, I think it's five rings. Each time you buy them, they increase uh, in price by ten ore chunks. So, first one's 30, then it goes to 40, 50, 60, and 70, I think is... I think it goes to 80, actually, so I don't know. Um, that's what I have here, most of them. Uh, blue luck ring, we've already got that, so 30 rupees for us, that's nice. Moblin ring, already have that, so yes, again. Quicksand ring, already got that one. Is this going to be complete? Yes, this is so far completely and utterly pointless, and yes, absolutely pointless. We just get random monies, though, so that's, you know, that's pretty nice. Um, not sure what we need with 690 monies, though. All things considered. Um, okay. Uh, I'm going to show you the area west of here, actually. Since I haven't showed you that yet. Um, I was thinking I'd save it until later. But I have changed my mind. Because I get the feeling that um, one of the things over there... Okay, here's, uh, here's the advanced shop for this place. Oh, is your life advanced? My life's advanced. From now on, it's advanced. Wow, you're a freak. Yeah, here's the advanced shop again, only for this game. I can't be bothered. I'll buy them off screen or something. Here's a house of notable birds. They're basically if you're a complete noob. As everyone everly one. Everly is not a word. Or is it? Um just gonna keep burning some trees. Cause you know, we hate the environment and all. Um just gotta make sure there's no old men hiding in those trees. <laughs> that sounded a bit wronger than it probably should have done, but here's a great fairy. See, told you so. Um, I'm good at remembering. Um, so, what do we want to do with you? Absolutely nothing. There's a treasure chest over there which we can't reach. There's a thing over here. We can't go over there yet. Um, we're running out of time for this video, but that's not a problem. Because, you know, time is irrelevant. Or is it an elephant? I, I wasn't paying attention. Um, so, yeah. In here... There's a crazy old man, Hero's Cave. This is where you would normally have gone in the original game, or if you're playing this without linking, to get yourself a sword, and there wouldn't be this crazy old man here. This is the Hero's Cave. Continue on if you trust your skills. I do indeed, but in the next part. Because I don't even know if we have all the stuff for this. So, yeah. Um, I think there's a few secrets going through here, so if you go through here and you, fi you find certain people who say, Hey! You should totally tell this to so-and-so back in Labrina. Yeah! Um, so yeah, I think there's a few things like that. Um, so that's pretty cool. And I shall return to you very soon, as far as I'm concerned, but probably tomorrow, as far as you can, you're concerned. See how you like it? I don't think, no. What? I don't know. Anyways, um, so yeah. I shall see you guys in the next part. Goodbye.